He is well, he's nominated in second place. But he is probably our best deadlifter in British powerlifting. Holds the world record at 386, which he did in Malta, to drag himself all the way up to the podium, the overall podium. Yeah, he finished these championships last year with a fabulous deadlift as well. I think he took the European record that day. Nice. That was 322 and a half for Indy Singh. And it was like an empty. Looking for 342 and a half. The biggest squat he's done in competition is 347 and a half that he did at the British. Missed 345 at World. got to help in any country though there's two or three people battling for supremacy yeah. to push each other on oh wow i think he's starting to approach his limit but that is a good lift for him sing villain This, if he's successful, it will be the third different lifter to break the European Open in the same competition. That's astonishing. Every eye glued on the flat Here we go. 3.49. The second has worked. Let's hope he can hit it really hard. No, no, not quite. I'm bringing it back up. So that gave Indy a best 250.5 kilos at the World Juniors early this year. What will he do today? While we wait to find out, this is Indy Singh Dillon. He's got a big squat, he's got a massive deadlift. First out to bench. 175 on the bar. the rack a little bit that's not a failure in itself okay. Indy Singh already on the bench for 180 the more he can lift on bench the less weight will have to go on the bar to win the title well we're all hoping for a big deadlift from Indy we've all seen him winding up that huge deadlift recently he hit 3.95 in the gym last week. So all of British powerlifting is hoping. Indy Singh already on the bench for his final bench press, 182 and a half. Harvesting kilos. This will match the best he's done in competition, which was at the British in March. Looks like a nice lift for Indy Singh, and we have seen that Veen Dick has put on the open world record. Lift, so I can really yep. try a big one with a third. You can't really risk that big one of the title could well, depend on it. Well, he in Malta he opened with 345, went straight to 375. So I expect him to smoke this and then take a big jump. Oh, effortless! He pulled 390. He is only six kilos off his own world record now. 300 kilos on the bar. And this would still leave him 15 and a half kilos behind. Well, we're all hoping for a 400 from Indy, but obviously he will load what he needs. These arbitrary round numbers aren't as important as winning the competition, but he has got a mountain to climb. I mean, Weindlich has gone up 15 kilos. 
And will that be just too big a target? I do expect Indy to load whatever he needs to win, but yeah. if it's going to be like 420, then... Maybe not. Maybe not. What did you say the record was, Joe? 386. The no, the, the op total record? Oh, um, the, in the European total yeah. record. Yeah. It is... is 952.5. But the junior record is 925.5. And here comes Indy Singh for a massive 380 kilos. Everyone wants to see this. And everyone wants to see the one that will follow it. Can the bearded warrior do it? Yes, he can. Oh, he smoked that. That is within six kilos of the world record. We know he can do it. Has he left enough in the tank for this? For everything. He is stalking down that bar. Here he comes. Listen to the crowd. Indraj Singh Dillon, 395.5 kilos to smash his own world record. It's going, it's going, it's going! He's it's locked gone. it! He's locked it out! In the Raj Singh Dillon is... Three wide lines! champion with a new world record.